According to Jens 360 military magazine, the Italian Air Force will receive a further 13 Alelia Air Machi M345 high efficiency trainer aircraft under a 300 million euros contract with Lear Lecter. The contract, announced on June 13, 2019, as to the five aircraft previously ordered under plans to replace the Italian Air Force current 137 MB339s and Ormantis 18M346. Deliveries of the first five M345s are due to begin in early 2020, while the Italian Air Force retains the total requirement for 45 M345 high efficiency trainer aircraft. First revealed in 2013, the M345 High Efficiency Trainer is the development of the baseline M345 Jet Trainer, which was a redesignation of the Air Machi M311. According to the manufacturer, M345 was developed based on the consolidated experience gained by aircraft division in designing and manufacturing its wide family of trainer aircraft in the past 60 years. Delivers the superior performance and training effectiveness typical of a jet aircraft at cost comparable to high-powered turboprop trainers. Aimed at the basics advanced phases of the pilot's training syllabus, the M345 offers high efficiency and low acquisition and operating costs. The M345 has an overall length of 9.85 meters, wingspan of 8.47 meters, and height of 3.74 meters. The wing area of the aircraft is 12.6 square meters. The aircraft has an empty weight of 3.3 tons and a maximum takeoff weight of 4.5 tons. The external load carrying capability makes the M345 suitable for secondary missions. Up to 1,000 kg of weapons on five hard parts, including gun parts, bombs, and rockets. Designed for training purposes, the M345 is a small tandem true seat shoulder wing monoplane. The student and trainer are seated under a single piece lightly framed tandem seat cockpit aft of a short nose cone. The fully digital glass cockpit is equipped with hands-drawn throttle and stick controls and three LCD multi-function displays for instructor and student pilot. The forward cockpit is fitted with a head-up display, while the rear cockpit is installed with a head-up display repeater. Other features of the cockpit include night vision goggles, compatibility along with an integrated global positioning system or inertial navigation system, digital moving map, and two mission computers. The strengthened airframe offers fatigue life of 15,000 fly hours. The tricycle landing gear of the training aircraft can be fully retracted. The wing main planes are shelter mounted and feature boundary layer fences for added control. The ambulance is dominated by a single vertical fin set over the engine exhaust port. Horizontal planes are featured at the base of the fin. The M345 is powered by a single Williams FJ44 4M34 turbofan. It is based on the early AMG S211 with the addition of both structural and equipment improvements. This engine developing a maximum thrust of 3,500 pounds at takeoff. Performance specification include a maximum speed of 740 km per hour, which rings out to 1,410 km, and a service ceiling up to 12,190 meters, and a rate of climb is 23.97 meters per second. A length of ground run required for a takeoff and landing of the aircraft are 460 meters and 450 meters, respectively. Lear Lector revealed, with the aircraft's sophisticated and better training simulation system, the pilot will see his training mission enhanced by a series of events which will have been arranged in a planning phase including other airplanes interacting with the mission itself and connected via detailing with flying assets, ground simulator and other simulation devices. The system also envisages the presence of a mission planning and debriefing station 
with which it is possible to prepare mission scenarios, upload and download data, and review the mission carried out in the debriefing phase. Promoted with the same cost as turboprop aircraft but that delivers superior performance, Liragler's training jet has piqued the interest of many air forces. My video of Air Magi M45 ends here. Thank you for watching. If you find this video interesting, please give me your thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to support the channel. Goodbye and see you again.